Welcome to the Hammer CRP unboxing, everybody. We've got 30 people here. Should I bother posting it on arm? Oh, I shouldn't, right? I shouldn't. Wondering, wow, that's a big box for keycaps. Yes, because I have I bought three sets, and then because of all the changes to it, it became six sets because it is no longer BSP. in here so I slide it away. So again, let me know when the U-Log gets annoying. I can turn it off, honestly. Do you want me to turn it off? We can leave the video on, but we can mute the audio. Oh, okay. They definitely picked the box that was too big. Wait, why did I only get three? There's no way they fit two sets into one, right? Did I just get ripped off? I just got ripped off. Wow, what? They only sent me three. Or two in each? Really? Okay. We'll find out. Okay, we will find out. Because see, on the... Let me hide the address. See on the packing slip? It only says these three. So these are the three that I ordered. And then it should come with another three. We will compare that with some other dice ops. I don't. I no longer have BSP on hand, but we will compare that with some other PBT dice ops that you can find on the market right now. So we will compare it with Enjoy PBT. We have the KP Republic set, and we have some Imsto to compare it with as well. So let's get started. Talisman Solutions, how's it going? Good to see you here. Still in ship the mine. Yeah, I like I said, I was surprised I got mine so early. Now I don't know which is which. I could look at the number, but fuck it. I'm definitely not keeping all six. I will try to sell three away. I mean, I ordered three, right? I don't need a six. 159, how's it going? Alex says, I still have to pay for the extra mod kit I ordered. How did I deal with the mod kit? So did you just get ripped off? Did it not offer anything extra? First one, here we go. Oh man, this cable. Fancy lights or anything. Space bars, space bars. Hey, they don't look awfully warped, so hopefully they're not. Yep, so two sets in a box. If you're receiving yours and you freak out, do not. Should we just go ahead and open? Yeah, let's just open all of them. Okay. 
see, it's perfect. I can sell three of these away because I have three of these boxes. So I can then ship them out in these boxes. GameCat, welcome to the stream. Do you want me to turn off the... I can turn off the audio for it, honestly, if it's annoying. Can you turn off the audio for the blue log? Oh, I can't. You want that? It, it popped there. Headphones were <laughs> fucking around. Okay. Let me know if you missed the sound. If you missed the sound, I'll, I'll, I'll turn it back up. No, it's absolutely real. I also have an AMD graphics card, so there's actual heat coming up from there. No, I don't. I don't. I actually have an NVIDIA card. One fifty nine. Yes, I will be home for the holidays. What about you? So that's why I'll be streaming tomorrow and on Christmas Day as well. I will do an unboxing for some keyboard stuff. I will do Lego builds. I'll probably do some gaming builds as well. Alexa is legit convinced that Anthony rejoined for the three sets just so he could open a knife three times on stream. Yes, it is. I actually don't like the way this knife flips open. I much prefer the, I don't know what it's called because I'm not a knife enthusiast. I much prefer when it's over here instead. I don't know what the hell you call that. I don't like this weird thumb thing. I really don't like it. We did the dice up. This is done by Hammer, who apparently did the dice up for the Insta Sex way back then. So we'll see. We'll find out. So many, many sets, many space bars. Wait a second. Okay. So it should be six point two five six and seven. Let's check the space bars first, make sure that they are straight. Wow. Oh, I spoke too soon. We'll put it on the board as well, let me. Take the keycaps off this board and put it on here. No, I did not get every set. So Tally, thank you so much for the gift sub to one fifty nine. Thank you, thank you, and 159, welcome to the Footlong Sub Club. Uh, no, I did not get every set. They offered four. I bought three of the four, I think. And then, in the end, they made some extra sets as remuneration, sort of. So, we'll talk about, uh, I'll talk about that as I take the keycap stuff. So, okay, what happened was, I will give you the link to the mass drop page for the set. Should I bother doing guest mode? That's the link. Let's take a look at it real quick. You know what? I need to turn on the fan. It's warm as hell. This is why I don't have an actual fireplace. It's warm, very warm. So if you will look at look at this page with me, you will see it was supposed to be Hammer BSP. So it's supposed to be BSP. Now BSP, what's so cool about BSP? They bought the molds for Cherry PBT keycaps and 
they had their issues though so when you buy BSP sets you won't get a space bar you won't get a numpad you are also limited to just a wind keyless layout again without a space bar and then the shift keys are warped really badly uh, just other issues but people really like them they they like that BSP sets the, the main I would say the main difference between them and say enjoy PPT Gadron keycaps for example modern chair profile PPT sets so the main difference is that the old ones BSP and OG chair had a very smooth silky texture to them they almost felt wet honestly the to me they feel like PBT caps that are just about to shine they you know to me it just feels horribly used that's why I don't I actually don't prefer the BSP feeling I know a lot of people like them I like the grittiness and the the, the, the matte rough texture of a lot of the modern PBT sets I, I actually prefer that to the smooth wet feeling of the BSP caps Okay, so here's what I got. I got this set. I got this set. I got this one. Greek uh, APL, uh, Tulip. I did not get this. And so what happened was they, this was gonna be BSP and that was the hype part, right? Because you could no longer buy BSP sets. BSP wasn't making anything anymore really. And so, they're saying, hey, this is your chance to get a BSP set. You know, they are going to make keycaps for this group bar, and we're gonna die sub them, and you can have access to BSP again. And then, months, months, months later, we hear nothing. Months, months, months later, we find out that they actually didn't confirm that BSP was gonna make it. And so BSP didn't respond. BSP just, I don't even know who was at fault really, but I will say the fault was with the people who did not tell us anything about it. Kept us in the dark, kind of. Uh, I guess also one reason they didn't want to do it was because they probably didn't want to cause any panic. They're trying to figure out, they're trying to make sure that, that BSP was legitimately not going to make the keycaps. And then they were probably gonna to try to find a solution or something first before they announce it uh, but even then I would have appreciated knowing a bit sooner but I also am not the type to, to make a big fuss on, on social media and stuff like that so I get that maybe they were trying to avoid a shit storm but anyway so uh, what ended up happening was they made hammer decided they he would they would make their own molds their own keycaps and so here we are I think that from pictures I'll say that CRP looks closer to modern PBT caps with the softer edges than BSP BSP has really sharp edges and almost a wider top surface Yeah, so you can read the discussion page. Uh, there was, uh, honestly, the, the, the way they fixed it, I honest, I actually wasn't pleased with the the resolution. I still am not. I still think that it was honestly a really crappy compromise in the end. Because what they did was, because it was no longer BSP, it was gonna be cheaper keycaps because they were gonna make it in, ho in the house technically, right? And what they ended up doing was they gave us a free set. So when you buy, instead of, you know, because we paid like, was it 160, 180? It was around 180, right? Let me see, how much was it? Damn it, it doesn't say. How much was it? Does anyone know? I don't want to, 170, 180, yeah, okay. So let's say 100, 170. Well, actually 180, because some of the other ones were even more expensive than that. Some of the ones were plus 25. So 180. They just said, oh, we're going to give you a free set as, you know, the, the, the resolution. But it sounds great. Like, wow, I got a free set. But here's the kicker. 
you could join the Taobao group buys and it was 87 or 86 dollars there. So really, you did not get free anything. It's literally the same price. I guess plus ship, yeah, because we even have to pay for shipping for, for mass drop as well. So if you bought it from the group buy directly, it ends up being the same price. And you could just pick whatever you wanted instead of being, and okay, here's another thing. So they said they're gonna make four other sets to give, to give for free, right? You don't get to choose which of the four you want. They just paired certain ones with each other. And so, and the way they paired it was really annoying as well because I ended up with three blue sets. And I didn't get a single green because they paired the green off with, with uh, so they paired the green set, I think green Hebrew with Tulip OG Ansi. And so I ended up with three, three of my six sets have blue die subs, uh, blue sub legends. Why? And so we, we basically had to pay for things we didn't order. And I actually, I'm not happy at all with that. I think that it was a shit solution. I I kept it just because it's probably gonna be difficult to pick one up <coughs> to, to stream an unboxing and then people just kept bugging me. They wanted me to keep the set and to stream so that's why I kept my order. Otherwise, I would not. I, I was actually happy in my refund. I got refunded the difference and I was happy with that. Uh, but for the stream, right? For the stream, so I kept uh, the sets. But yeah, it was honestly such a shit resolution. The least they could do was to let us pick which of the four we wanted. That's the least you could do. If you really forced us to buy those four sets, at least give us the, 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 the a, a, a choice. Right? We didn't even get a choice. They're like, this is gonna be limited edition. We're never gonna make this sets again. Limited edition. There's nothing sacred in this hobby. Let's be real. Nothing is fucking sacred. It's gonna be the last time we make this. And then, you know, the next two, three, four times. Last time we're gonna make this. Last time we're gonna make this. So who knows? Who knows if this is really gonna be the only time that we're gonna produce some of these sets. But yes, overall, terrible resolution. Uh, honestly, it makes me, I don't know who had a hand in this. I wonder if it was Hammer's idea or it was Mass Drop's idea, whatever. They both gave the okay, so fuck whoever made that decision. Terrible fucking garbage customer service. Again, you say, then why did you keep it? Well, people wanted someone to, to give an overview and review them, so that's why I kept them. I don't even know what the resale value is. You're gonna think, oh, maybe you kept it to flip it. I don't even know what the resale value is gonna be because uh, there was a Taobao group buy for some of these sets. So again, if you ever get promise, something limited edition or some bullshit, instead of just a straight up refund, just be, just be wary because again, nothing is sacred. So almost any time, if you can get a partial refund or a full refund, go with that. Take the cold hard cash. You'll be like, oh yeah, I'll take an extra PCB. Or I'll take an extra, it's almost always bullshit. Or we'll give you a, 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 a this limited, you know, J-Chan tried to do that with the M65. Oh no, we're not M65, with the Master Control uh, Rebirth sets. So it had been a year, nothing was produced or something, or he was missing a lot of sets. So basically, they shipped him the sets. He took forever to ship them out. He didn't even check what he received. So by the time enough people had bugged him to ship out the sets, he found out that a lot of them w were never sent to him. And by then, it was too late. You know, factory had just, just stopped responding. And again though, you don't expect to hear back. You know, like six months down the road, some guys are, hey, you didn't send me everything. Well, it's been six months. What the hell, dude? Um, and, and so yeah, so you know what his resolution was? He tried to offer these limited edition, I think it was like 3D printed artisans or something. It wasn't even anything impressive. 
Get limited edition. Fuck off of that crap. And again, why would I want to keep my order just for some crappy looking artisan? I don't even care about artisan and it looked bad. It looked cheap. That's the worst part. Green Savage, how's it going? I guess the vote passed for today. Yes. Mo, uh, I think. Let me check the survey. What was it? Seventeen votes for today over seven. So that's what we're doing it today. Shit happens is a hobby. No, the thing is, yes, shit happens. Absolutely. But I can say it was bad. I can say it was bad. Just because bad things happen doesn't mean I can't say it's bad. All right? I am just being honest and just telling you it's a shitty resolution. Yes, sure. Terrible things happen. But I can call it terrible. Doesn't mean hammer and mash up with terrible people. I just said the resolution itself was terrible. You can be a good person and do make a bad decision. Or you could be a terrible person and make some good decisions. What a sweet ad money. Yes, sweet ad money. I think I make... How much did I make a month? So like less than five bucks a month, YouTube ads. So I think my entire career on YouTube, I made $12. $12. That's why I stopped. I cut all the ads on my YouTube channel because it's not worth it for me. I'd rather you not deal with ads. Let me just receive fucking like four bucks a month for some shit. Violet Barstar, how's it going? You're just gonna join that HP buy? Yeah, you can just pull out if they delay it. So, yeah, just do it. Just put your money in. Just get a hundred or something. Don't overdo it though. No, I think that it's not a matter of whether you can afford it or not. You know, because I know some people who are very well to do and they've quit the, you know, they can more than afford rent. And they quit the hobby because they were just sick and tired of all the bullshit. They, I think mostly it was just dealing with customer service and you know, constantly having to email people to keep up with things like, hey, did you finally ship this out? Hey, or you know, like, oh Ben, it's been six months since I last heard. Like, you know, is there anything? Or, oh, I, do I have to change my address? Oh, I have to submit another, I have to pay for another invoice. Oh, I have to do this, I have to do that. Like, it, 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 it takes so much effort just to buy things that it's annoying. It's like, I just, it's fucking, like, why do I have to keep, and the worst part is, the burden ends up being on the customer of the participant. It's so stupid. It's like, but why? I gave you money. Why do I have to jump through so many hoops just to get what I paid for? And again, this is from, you know, people who are actually stores and stuff like that. And, and so yeah, it is not a matter of, oh, don't spend around on your hobby. Because they could easily spend a hundred times whatever you spent on the hobby and they can say they get they get the choice to say that something was a terrible decision and no I completely disagree with that Tali I think that that if I spend on a hobby I get to say whether or not I got my money's worth I 
I absolutely disagree with that. And especially because, again, I'm tired of, of people reviewing stuff and then not telling me what to expect. Why do you think I started a channel? Why do you think I started streaming? Why do you think I started doing reviews? Because I, I, I you know, so much, it's like everything's great, everything is good. New Switch, wow, amazing, wow, amazing. Ooh, Hako Switch, great tactile Switch. And everyone's like, I don't, it, doesn't feel, it doesn't feel tactile to me at all. You know, it's even a smaller bump than uh, an MX Brown. Very tactile, good Switch. Yeah, so, I uh, yeah I I don't I don't subscribe to that I don't I don't think that that everyone should be sucking each other's dicks I think that if something's good you can say it's good if something's bad you can say it's bad if someone made a, a horrible business decision the customer gets to say like you know anyone involved or not gets to say whether it was a good or bad decision you can talk about it right are people's feelings so are people so sensitive these days that you cannot talk about whether Someone fucked up or not? Yeah, so... Let's see. Jubei says... And Jubei, welcome to the stream. I uh, hope I didn't miss anyone else. It says, Evil 80 group by was like that. I had to bug the group by runner on Geekx so many times to get any new information. He finally was done and gave me the runner and China's QQ number. I had to work with him directly to get information. Yeah, see, that sucks because it's like I've already paid this money. Why do I have to do all this shit? And the worst part is you have to do all that too just to get your money back. It's like, really? You know, either you get your money back or you get the product and you have to do so much. Then we says, all the shit I deal with, the hit V1, C225, and the uncertainty of the number one at a time, it's the reason why I'm not joining any more custom board group buys. Yeah? That shit, people are like, oh, it's just, it's just the way it is, man. So it's a sm small enthusiast community. No. There are some big bucks being thrown around these days. So people should expect better. Things are never going to get better if people, like, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, everything's fine. I don't get my money, I don't get my, you know, like $500. The thing is, if you just join one, it feels, and you know, you feel like, oh, I don't care, it was just one. It's, it's, it's something else when you join 10. And like eight of them, you have to constantly check up on. Is that Heo Charles? Let's call you Charles. Hi, finally was able to catch you. Well, welcome. Finally able to catch you here in Twitch chat. H two O okay, well I'll say H H two O. Yeah, I think that, especially that, like I said, as a reviewer. That's why I mean I haven't joined a lot of group buys recently because yeah I'm 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 sick and tired of most the, the way most group buys are run. Absolutely sick and tired. And yeah, so as a reviewer, as someone that makes content, I think that I have even more of a responsibility to tell you whether or not something to, 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 to weigh in on whether or not something was, was properly done. Hey look, the space bar works. That's good. Already better than Joy PBT. Hey yo, there we go. Kido or Kaido, welcome, welcome. How's it going? Maybe he says, what's on the menu for the holidays? I don't know yet. Maybe I'll go to a Chinese restaurant tomorrow. Don't know. It's prime rib and pulled pork, pork and waffles for me. That sounds pretty nice. Are you, are you making the prime rib? What are you putting on the prime rib? Are you going to put any kind of barbecue sauce on it or anything like that? Daredevil, how's it going? Are you are you flying yet? 
It's in the evening, right? Late afternoon, evening. All right. So which one do we want to see on this board? Please let me know. So again, what are, what are your options? So we have... And we can always, you know, use these sets on uh, other boards that we build. So we don't have to see all of them right now. So we have Arabic, which is black and blue. I do not want to see the Japanese one. So no, do not ask for the Japanese one. I am just as sick and tired of Japanese sub legend keycap sets. That's the only one I'm not doing. You can ask for literally anything else except the Japanese one. So this is the Japanese one. I'm not putting it on a keyboard. So black and pink though. Pretty nice, I like the pink. It is a nice muted pink. I will I will compare I will take them out all of them. Ooh, look at that. So this is the OS key. Nice little mountain. Mount Fuji, I'm assuming. That's the only hip mountain I know of and and it's thicker than EPBT. We will do that. We'll do the comparison in a little bit. We will compare the space bars as well. We'll compare the, the actual keycaps. We'll compare the KP Republic. I just want to put one on this board first and then we'll do the comparison. We'll compare all the colors as well. The die sub legends. We'll do all that. GameCat wants to see APL. Alex Green Hebrew. Ugh, I gotta adjust my glasses, Alex. Okay. This, this. And then we've got what is this? This is the Cyrillic set. board <laughs> shut up about Hebrew uh, let's see yeah, so we have just Cyrillic as well but it is not uh, sub -legends. yeah Cyrillic is another one I don't want to do because the so Cyrillic and Japanese I don't want to do because I've we have so many of those sets I've owned so many of those sets So many Cyrillic and, 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 and Japanese sets, so I think I won't do that as well. But yeah, they are very common. So you get these cherry keys. So again, we will compare, we'll actually take them apart. And, oh my god. Oh my god. You know how some people treat text messaging like instant messaging? If you do that, don't. Dead Wing Dick, thank you so much. Eight months in a row. Thank you, thank you. Okay, here's a little cherry icon key. Pretty cool with the black outline as well. One of the cooler ones actually. The other ones they don't it's not as detailed as this one. Look at that. You can even see the leaf leaf has the these lines on the inside. Pretty neat. Louis Cipher and B says my wife breaks every sentence before a message is so annoying. Yes! Oh see like instant messaging. I usually have silent notifications for those text messages I like to leave them open just in case it's an emergency you know like say someone is supposed to pick you up or you're meeting someone somewhere and they're like you know oh, I'm here 
you know and so it's usually you, when, when you need something and so that's why I leave the sound on just in case right just in case and, and there's a message I need to see immediately and and yeah but when you break it up into just multiple messages and it just just keeps pinging and going off oh my god drives me insane Caps lock looks really weird. Okay, we will check out the caps lock as well. I thought these things were Twitch notifications. No, yeah, it's just text messages. Okay, what else do we have? We have Greek. Ooh, do we want to do the Greek one? I was thinking either Greek or Arabic. Or APL, actually. APL is pretty cool, too. Let's, do you want to do APL or do we do... Actually, let's do... We could put APL into a, a keyboard tray, a keycap tray. And then we can do... Okay, you know what? What else is this one? This is blue. Is this Hebrew? I don't even know what I got, man. Um, so yes, I got Hebrew blue. It's not green. So, do we want Hebrew blue or do we want APL? Do we want tulip? Greek tulip. So the thing about Greek tulip that's cool. Look at that. So we'll 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 we'll, we'll check that out. Then we'll take a closer look at this later on. Look at that. Look at all those colors. Whitey Fool, how's it going? Hey, <laughs> Brunians. Man, that question. Do not ask that in Malaysia, though. Malaysia does not recognize Israel as a nation state. If, you're, if you have an Israeli passport, you can't even travel to Malaysia. That's how serious it is. I have no problems with them. It's just a fucking backwards ass. Pieces of shit in Malaysia. Okay. Which one? Which one do we do? Because I, I have two keycap trays over here as well. So we basically are going to take out three sets. And we're going to lay out three sets. So. Yes, at least the food is good. Yes, absolutely. Absolutely. Is it really the most popular Islamic state? Is it in Indonesia? I think Indonesia doesn't have a, an official religion, right? But it should be Indonesia. Because Indonesia is like the third, no, f fourth most populous nation in the world. Yes, fourth. Can you compare the blues? Okay, we'll compare the blues as well. Going to my buddy's bar mitzvah. I've never been to a bar mitzvah. BPS says Indonesia just got hit with a tsunami that's killed over 60 people. Oh, so maybe they're not fourth most populous anymore. <laughs> Just kidding. Indonesia has two point 
263 million people. Okay, so let's do Greek. Okay, let's do Greek. I'm stuff. Uh, I'm stuff. Let's do that. Oh man. VPR, I, I, I guess. So when when did they just get hit? Actually, I, I have not kept up. I have been pretty busy the past few days. Uh, I know Malaysia, the only tsunami that we really got hit by was in 2014, that crazy ass tsunami that hit Aceh. Insane. Uh, I still remember we had to go to school the next day and that was the first time a lot of us had experienced any sort of earthquake before. And yeah, I remember it was big news at the time. Yesterday, okay, yeah, I have not checked the news. Okay, so let's do Greek. Let's do that. So we can see these pretty colors. Uh, I don't even know how they are supposed to go on the board. I'll probably look at a picture somewhere. Okay, first of all, check this shit out. So hey, looks like they kept true to BSP. God is here! How's it going? So God did not rejoin the buy, so after he got refunded, he just said... No, he actually asked for a refund before Master refunded him. So he actually lost $20 twenty dollars in store credit because I got a free act twenty dollars basically for staying you're making BSP but better yes look at that Oh, these have row five as well. That's probably worth mentioning. Look at that. Look at how big bottomed this keycap is. Look at that. So this is row four and most other chair profile sets, you're gonna see this also for the space bar row, for the bottom row. The bottom two rows are the same profile in case you haven't noticed. Whereas over here, look at this. So this is supposed to be row five. Look at that. 14 by 71. Welcome. How's it going? Oh my god, what happened to that L key? Holy shit, that's bad, dude. I guess this is the set for box switches. My god. It tilts in the opposite direction as box switches. So maybe you should just swap that switch out for a box switch Mo modern problems require modern solutions isn't that from uh, uh, <laughs> Dave Chappelle it's from Chappelle right I think so Yes. <laughs> well, hopefully mine aren't going to be so bad, but I have six sets, so they're bound to be bad. Okay, so they come with row four and row five, bottom row. I actually just use the row four. I'm going to, I'm going to use row five.
absolutely reprehensible. Yeah, giving us such a shitty resolution, absolutely. Well, these actually got cheaper, right? That's why they gave us a free set. I hate that they called it a free set. I still fucking hate that they called it a free set. You get a free set. We're not refunding you though. You still pay like double what it's worth. Pay for two, get one free. So this blue is definitely different from the he than the Arabic blue, which is good to know. I have three blue sets, right? So yeah, so this blue is different. Could I just bought Gar I, I I wish they just I wish they just done that, I'll be honest. They fucking feel just like get on caps. So, if you want it, silky smooth PVT, like that wet texture. If you like that wet silk, silky smooth texture, BSP and OG cherry, this is not it. Because this has a more matte texture, which I like. But maybe you don't. <laughs> How did they even arrange these keycaps? It's like them all over the place. Oh my god. No, there's no R. Rance pones and also high rance pones. There's no R. That's what I was looking for. By the Viceroy, I what language did I decide on? Apparently the one that doesn't have an R. How to ruin Christmas in one simple stream. So I guess we are not using this set anymore because we are missing keys. Let me go ahead and show the crazy dice ops first. And I guess, see, I guess I'll have to talk to fucking Mass Drop. I'll have to submit a ticket and ask for my missing key. You know what would have been nicer than that? Not having to do that.
Are you sure it's missing? So they sort these keys by profile. You wanna know what's hilarious? Look at this shit. Oh my god, are you fucking serious? So we're missing R. Look at the sub legend for R. Okay, so let me show the five color die sub. Since we're gonna put this side away, I'm gonna take these keycaps off and I'm gonna bag and set it aside. And then apparently I have to message Master again. I still have to talk to them about my missing XDS Scrabble keys. Guess this one. Oh, not just five, it's actually six colors. Look at that, isn't that an insane die sub? Look at that, that is crazy. Got mass dropped, yes, and that's spelled double P. M A S S D R O. Oh, but I can't spell mass dropped because guess what? There's an R in mass dropped. So, yeah, so this is really cool. This is not cool at all. Tony or Tony? Is it Tony? Welcome, welcome. I hope you're having a better Christmas than I am. Because this is absolutely reprehensible. I need to get rid of that keycap puller because I don't even like it. Can't even spell Christmas without the missing R. Can't even smell, sm spell hammer or CRP. Can't spell Greek either. Frosted flax, that E is crooked. I don't know if I prefer crooked or completely non-existent. Fun spoiler, how's it going? Just get a sharpie and turn the P into an R. You're onto something. You actually are onto something. It's like a last ditch option and sell it brand new. Rama will bring 68 back after Christmas. No. I have not because Rama also starts with an R. Okay, this shift looks funky as hell. Is it does it look crooked to you? That does not look right to me. Ha, 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 ha. 
<laughs> Be banned new. Guess what the best part is? Because the first thing we opened, literally that's the second bag, right? The second bag. So the first key cap bag, the set we opened, already had a missing key. You know what that means? That means I have to go through all fucking six of these. I have to check them all one by one to make sure nothing is missing. I can't even count key caps because we got double peed. So, it's funny, right? You think it would be the Russian set that would have the PP, but no. Um, anyway, yeah. So I have to check everyone, every single one of them. People ask me, "Well, oh, what did you do this goodbye?" Well, guess what? Because I'm sick of this stupid shit. This is the. Yes. I'll guess what. Okay, let's do another set. Miago, how's it going? We are missing a key. Literally second, so first set I opened, already missing a key. Uh, I was doing great until I unboxed this. So let's do Hebrew. Christmas season. Jesus spoke Hebrew. So if the Hebrew set is missing keys, we're gonna have one upset birthday boy. Hey brother, how's it going? How's it? Uh, uh, could be better. Could be better. You can say he's tilted. Check every single one of these. You know one of the reasons why they sort by row? So that they don't miss anything. So that they don't have any missing keys. Well guess what happened?
Now because I check them all the time anyway. Yeah, I do. But not immediately. That's the thing. And so, but this gun, I guess I have to, just, I have to get it done. This is why, man. Buy GMK. I have purchased. So, so, so many GMK sets. Never had a problem with any single one of them. I've purchased so many. Look at that. Look at that. How do you spell crooked? It starts with a C. Fucking amazing. You know what, here's what I think I'm gonna do. I'm gonna see how much they're worth on Mac Market. If I do not get more more money than they're worth, I'm just gonna return them all to Mass Drop because I am Why didn't they just fucking buy Gad or Cast or something? I, I I really don't understand that. So did Hammer fuck up? So again, I don't know who made the decision, you know, to, to do the whole free set bullshit and the decision to, to pair certain sets together. I don't know whose fault that is, but the keycaps. Being crooked and shit, that's on that's on hammer. They fucked up. Over there. This is not acceptable, I think. Oh, it's just a few keys. You pay money for this shit, man. It's not a twenty dollar product. Alright. If we keep that whole free set free again free set if we keep that that narrative that means i still paid 180 dollars for this shit i paid 180 dollars for this and whichever one was this is free so that means i did not pay 90 bucks for this i paid 180 dollars well guess which set i paid fucking 80 dollars for and we didn't have that crooked bullshit Enjoy PBT, Cape Republic. Best die sub legends in the market. And so what? It's like if, if you got one of those, you, you know, makeup YouTubers and you got them to put makeup on a pig. Still a fucking pig. I know, I meant like a literal pig. I, don't, I didn't mean like, you know, ugly women or whatever. I meant like actual. Never mind. Uh, this 
This is why, man. The only time you can really trust Mass Drop is if they are having an actual corporation, an actual business, do the thing. If it's anything that's made by Mass Drop, as in things that are new. Just for example, if it's an audio thing, say like the, San the, the Sennheiser HD, you know, 6XX. That's still made by Sennheiser. Sennheiser deals with all that stuff. And then Mass Drop just is the storefront for it, basically. That's fine. But if you're doing anything... It's like made in house. Prepare to get your ass fucked without your consent. And if you do like that, without your consent, and with glitter lube, All right? So, but no, maybe you'd like to too. But uh, yes. Do not trust anything that's new and, you know, made just for that run because it's probably going to be garbage. We got three types of homing keys. We got scoop, bar, and nipple. All three. There's an R in rape, so oh. Oh no. Yeah, so at least we get to show it all on stream. So that's good. So you actually get four homing keys. You know what would have been nicer than four homing keys? Making sure that nothing is missing. Tronics, hello, how's it going? Hebrew blue looking good nonetheless. Okay, yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna show I'm gonna compare the blue after we put all this down and then I'm gonna put another set onto some trays. And then we'll compare them with Gadron and GPT. I actually still have Gadron caps in a bag somewhere. X Popai, Popage, welcome. Uh, not a lot, except uh, disappointment. Spacebar warped as well. This one isn't. This one actually works. I'll have to test all of them out, but I won't do that today.
So one good thing at least, right? You know what? Here's another thing. I can't just put them all out and then compare. Uh, I can't just put them, say, on a tray to count all the keys. Because someone got crooked. And if I'm going to keep anything, I want. Okay, look at look at that. That That's crooked too. There's a big gap over here. So that means I can't just pour them out on a desk, you know, arrange them to see, to count them because some are going to be crooked. I need to find out which ones are crooked. That means I need to actually put them on a fucking keyboard, take each key off and then put another set on to check everything. Because of other sets, that's that's never been a problem, right? Other sets, I can just put them on a desk, put them here. You know, I usually do it here. I pour them out, and I'll arrange each one to see if I have everything, and I'll take a picture of it or whatever just to remember, just as proof basically, and then put it back in the bag. With this, I will have to put it on a keyboard. Wow, look at number nine. Abortion is right. Yeah, this, this keycap definitely leans left a little. I think eight is the one that's crooked. Eight is the one. You're right. Supply side Jesus is the way. Oh yes. Absolutely. Number eight. I suspect it. It's a bit right leaning. Everything, man. Every fucking thing. Yep. So my crooked keys. I really doubt I will keep any of these now. Honestly, I really, really doubt it. I... Here's the hilarious part. If I just return them all, I didn't actually gonna check if I returned every key. Good luck. Try to do that. Imagine, imagine if, if I just asked for a refund, I returned the Greek tulip and like, I'm sorry, we have to cancel the refund because it's missing an R. All the fun of having box switches built right into the keycap. So Gawk, if you're out there, please save us. For those of you who don't know, Gawk is the one who has been working with KBD fans to redo a lot of Enjoy PVT legends and stuff. He's fixed a lot of the legends. He is doing great work. Probably, honestly, in terms of keycaps, 
I would say he is doing the best work right now uh, in in advancing the the space in in in, in keycaps, as in the realm of keycaps, not the space bar, because he's actually you know he got the Android PPT files, tweaked them, fixed the legends, and then now is actually changing them to to make them look even better and more consistent. So at first he just made them consistent. And now he's tweaking them to make them look even nicer. So before it was just fixing, and then now it's actually improving. So he was the one behind Android PPT Black on white. He is also working Grace. He also had a hand in working on Grayscale. And then Kuroshiro, which is also a black on white set with the Japanese sub legends, that one. Uh, will be his next set. So I guess it's up to him. What about the legends? Okay, that's not that's 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 not okay. Hold on. Over here, look at the letter A. See how the thickness of the lines is about the same as you know the thickness for for all the other letters. See that? It's uh, you know it's it's pretty much the same, or it looks very very close. Correct. See that? Look at Q, look at W, look at E, R, T, okay? You have this idea of thickness in your mind. All right? Look at A. So I take back saying that the dice up is good. The A alone, I'm gonna say this is below average. The actual legends themselves They look all right, not bad, but so what if you can print things nicely if the thing you're printing is fucking disgusting to begin with? Yeah, it's not just the A, yep. Okay, look at the G. For comparison, and again, this is Android PPT, this is just 
fixed NJPPT is not even improved NJPPT. The new ones are going to look even better because Gawk is going to be working on them. Okay, so you have the G looking like that, okay? So yeah, so it's thicker around here and it thins out a little bit over here, right, at the ends. Because you know, it is, it's a lot uh, cramped up over there. Look at this one. See how it thins out so early that it just looks kind of awkward? Because for this one, you will see that... Let me, just, let me grab some... This part, this end over here, is about as thick, looks about the same as this end over here, correct? You see that? They are both thinner than this part over here, but at least these two are the same, correct? This one on the other hand, This is you. This is the guy she tells you not to worry about. Look at the girth on that shit compared to this. In pencil dick over here. Ron Jeremy over here. Gawk, not God. You know what? That settles it. I'm gonna see what my return options are in Mass Drop. I've already made up my mind. Unless I can get at least 150 for each set. Actually, maybe 150 is a bit much. I can count each one in an hour. So, unless I get 150. Yeah, yeah, yeah 150, because otherwise, it's not worth my time. Maybe 140. Okay, unless I get 140. Any of these sets, I'm returning them. Not worth my trouble. Not worth my time putting them, count, count, you know, counting each set, uh, each key individually, dealing with buyers on Mac Market. And for those of you who use Mac Market a lot, you know how many idiots there are out there. Dealing with that, shipping things out. That's not worth it, man. So, unless I get at least 140, I am I'm just returning them if I if I can. I'm gonna have to contact Mass Drop. But again, we're showing them all on camera, so we've all got proof over here. Am I keeping any of them? You ask. The CRP, the savior. Of PBT. Was it really worth waiting? Was it how long was the group by? When did this happen? Oh my god, it's a separate transaction because they make us they made us rebuy it. Anyway. So what do I think so far of Hammer CRP? Just like Mouse is fine says, it's crap. It's crap.
And NGB, thank you so much for being here again. Thank you so much for the gifts. Have fun. Have a good Christmas with your family. Enjoy Harry Potter. Petition of God run a set Porsche yellow. He would not do yellow. He would actually do... Knowing him, it would probably be a blue or a, or a... I guess he would still want a green set, but mostly blue and purple. Green is his favorite color. Though. So, you know what? I'm not gonna put them out on to the keycap trays anymore, unfortunately. It's just gonna be pointless, right? Putting them all out on a keycap tray, and then if I just, I'm just gonna return them anyway. Putting them all back into a bag. So I will open them up, and we will look at the the the, the keys at least. The, the the colors. We will compare it with. Some other PPT keycaps, I'm just gonna call it. I'm not gonna put them in trades anymore because it's pointless. It's it's so where's the time? Okay, so I'm gonna grab no just want not to see the colors. I mean it's kinda of pointless to look at the Cyrillic one because it's just black anyway. We will still look at them. So for those of you who were interested in the Cyrillic set, this was not part of the original group buy. Cyrillic Legends, look at that. So this is just basically just Cyrillic. Kind of Yuri, I guess. Are the sub legends any good? There were some things I wasn't very happy about, and I will show you in a bit. What are the sub legends? So you can see that the font they decided to use is a. a, a the word is, whoops, sans serif, right? Sans serif is without tail, without the, so just flat sans serif and print instead of script. So they are supposed to just be just straight lines basically with rounded edges, right? But look at this one over here. I don't know how well you can see it, but you can see that it's not completely straight. Look at that. You see how it's a bit flubbed over here, like it's a little thicker. You see that? And you see how this line is not, it's not a completely straight line. It's like it's, it's like a cucumber almost a little thicker on the, in the middle part. Do you see that? So, they're not perfect. They're not perfect. And again, because Mashdrop decided to call these free, I don't know if Mashdrop or Hammer, I'm not going to rate it at the $90 price point. I'm rating it at the $180 price point. And $90, should you buy it? Answer is probably still no. $180? Hell no. Hell no. But again, maybe you have different priorities. Maybe you like the look. Go for it. You want to buy these keycaps? 
$140, hit me up. Because I'm not keeping them. Again, you'd be surprised at the amount of people who don't care about the legends and don't care about these things. Look at how many successful group buys JTK has had. Apparently people don't care. But maybe people don't care at the 60 to $80 price point. $180 though. Maybe people will start caring. Ma'am, welcome to the stream. Says, what's the texture of the caps comparable to? Gadron keycaps. Not new Android PPT. It's so old Android PPT. Because new Android PPT no longer uses Gadron keycaps, as far as I know. It's no longer sourced directly from Gadron. Or at least not the same finish as old Gadron caps. Yeah, it should not even be the same because the space bar is not even the same. I just explained. I've mentioned it at least three times already. Because Master or Hammer called the extra sets free and not, hey, you're paying for two sets. We didn't get a choice. But what the second set would be? They called it a free set. And again, we didn't get a choice of what the second one was. So it's not $90. We paid $180. If they just did a partial refund and just paid us back the difference to $9, sure. But no, because of the wording, I cannot call it $9, all right? Because yeah, we were forced to buy two. We we're forced to buy the second one. We didn't get a choice, really. It's either you stay and you pay for the second one or you don't buy it at all. And now I'm thinking, maybe I should not even have bought it at all. But hey, we, we needed someone to look at it, right? How many other channels are gonna actually judge all these legends so we got the Sakuron over here this one it's APL okay so we'll take a look at APL we'll take one bag out which one is this Sakuron here or Japanese Arabic we'll take one bag of Arabic out we already looked at Cyrillic Oh, I know that if you buy from China, it's sub 100. It's cheaper than $90. It's like $86 or $87 before shipping if you buy from China. That's why I said it's bullshit that they called it a free set. They made it sound like they were rewarding us. When really, uh, literally the same price. We're not really getting anything. You never get to choose what you want. You never get to say, no, I don't want the extra sets. Just give me what I paid for, give me partial refund. Nope. But yeah, that's the least you could do, right? But no. Which Android PD sets are considered new? It depends which generation you're talking about. I believe they stopped being Gateron from the, even the Sushi sets. Those are not OG anymore. I believe it was only the OG ones, which are the ones with the terrible legends. Not terrible, terrible, but compared to what you, compared to new Android PD, I would say it's actually terrible. Uh, which is funny. Which is funny, because people used to say Android PPT Legends were great. Gawk had access to the actual files, and he confirmed the files themselves had lots of inconsistencies between the Legends. So leg a lot of Legends were just randomly different sizes. For no reason. So for example, like, like it's kind of like this, right? Like, the A is just randomly just a different thickness. Like, it's like they bolded everything and then just left out one. 
right? So there are a lot of things like that, or like for example, like a like control, like the second half of the letters would be a different font size compared to the first half, or some bullshit, some weird shit like that. Yeah, like as in just lots of just actual errors, because he had the files. And so he had to fix that. So that's why the the black on white and PPT got those fixed. And then now he's actually putting his own twist on it, just making them look even better. I don't know, Hebrew, Arabic. Wait. Am I missing one? Oh. Oh. Let me pull it out from the trash can. You can use the uptime command for it, Arzark. So it's gonna be. Exclamation mark, uptime, all lowercase. So let's compare the blues first. I know people are interested in that. As you can see, all three blues are different, so that's nice. The Arabic blue is a navy blue. The Hebrew is a bit more indigo a bit more lavender if you will so a bit more think a bit more purple in it and then the apl is a light blue not a cyan it cyan would be a bit greenish right uh, same with teal as well a bit, a bit more greenish teal a bit more a bit greener than cyan so not cyan, but light blue. So I could just think less blue, basically. Yeah, Greek tulip, yeah. So just less blue. So, but yeah, so that's nice. At least all three blue sets are different blues. It's kind of good. That's definitely good, at least. And the, uh, this is so sad because I really like the Arabic sub legends on this one. And I'm not saying that just because I grew up in Malaysia. Uh, Muslim nation, of course. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm not Muslim though, but still, but this is... See, so this is script instead of print. You see, it's like calligraphy, basically. And it looks so nice. It looks so nice. So good. And I definitely prefer it to the Android PPT version. That one I think uses print instead. Or no, or... But that one, basically, their legends weren't as... The font choice and positioning weren't as good. I compared them last time... It was a long time ago I talked about those. Uh, I compared those two. Uh, just using pictures and stuff. So it's a shame, because I really like these legends. I really, really like it. I like the contrast between... The print, the print, the uh, primary legend, and then the script sub legend. All right, so let's compare Hebrew, APL, and the Japanese GK Tulip. As you can see, these are the colors. Very red, red. All right. Oh my god. Is it just me or are these arrows not the same? I mean, you dumbass, they're reversed. No, no, I don't just mean that. Uh, but you see how this arrow has a sharper head than this one? Or is that just me? Do you see that? 
This arrow basically looks better than this one. See how the, 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 the lines on these are just straighter, sharper? This one is... Yes. You can see how over here it almost looks like either it's straight or it's concave. Compared to this where you can see that where the arrowhead meets the shaft, there's like a bit of thickness there. It makes it almost look convex. Do you see that? Yeah, of course it's negligible. I'm not saying that this is a deal breaker. These are the things I have to point out. I know people are like, well, I don't really care. I'm not saying you should. Also, I'm Seth. Thank you so much for being here. Have a good night and a good Christmas. Stay warm. And happy holidays. Yeah, but these are things that, again, I have to point out. Whether or not it matters to you is a different story. It matters to some people. These are the colors. Oh, actually I can show the GK Tulip. Yeah, so let me put these back in the bag and then we will compare it with some other PVT keys that we have. Make sure I'm putting them back into the right place. Arabic goes back into the Arabic bag. Which one is it? This one. Why are some of the caps so washed out? You mean the, for example, like the pink over here? So you mean that? So it's, it's, just a, it's just a color choice. It's just a light pink is all. This is Tulip, GK Tulip. Put these back. This one is the one in the trash can, right? Yep. And put it back in the box. This is APL. Japanese. And the Japanese one actually has, instead of black legends, it has brown legends. I don't know if you notice that, it's like brown and pink actually. See that? So it's not black and pink, it's brown and pink. So I think kind of like the, the famous uh, chocolate, the strawberry chocolates, the Japanese one. So I think that, or just an asshole, I guess. Most of these aside. Now bring the old gather on.
Actually, some of the install sets should be all get on as well. It means I never need to bring this up. It says Android PBT uh, Japanese. We'll take one key out. Cape Republic. Actually, I don't even need to take this, right? I can just use. Where did I go? This is the Taiwan Sub Legends or Wopo Mofo. So basically, Chinese, but this is the system that uh, is mostly used in Taiwan. Chinese is typically typed in pinyin, which is a, what's the word, anglicized. So you use, you can type using a, a, an ANSI keyboard or whatever. You're basically writing out the pronunciations. Whereas in Taiwan, it is popular to use the popomorpho system or zu yin or something like that, where it's parts of the, the the Chinese character. It's kind of a weird system. Uh, basically, only Taiwan uses it, honestly. Almost every other country that does have use Chinese use uh, Pinyin. And then we have Imsto. This is the Japanese one, though, it's, it's kind of different. But we're just going to show the keycaps. And we're gonna compare the space bar as well. So space bar from here. Let's the space bar from here. Oh you know what? Uh, actually it should be fine. They all have different shades. I should be able to figure out which is which. Hammer and APPT the same? No, 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 not at all. Not at all. That's how we're comparing them. So first let's compare the space bars. I'm gonna see if I remember. Okay, so this is definitely the KP Republic because you can recognize it from the gray instead of beige. It's a light gray instead of beige. This is install, I want to say. No, that's not right. Wow, now I'm confused. Uh, hold on. I believe this should be install, right? I need new Android PPT as well. So let me. Yes. Let 
But yeah, this is the video. That's fine. Okay. So, compare space bars. Fabrox has just ordered GMK Plum. Very nice from Kibbity Fans. Can we see my first GMK set? If you like the colors, then I think you'll be very pleased. Let's put the hammer one at the bottom. So CRP at the bottom. Let's do KB Public and then Imsto and Android PBT. So these are 6.25, this is 6U, 6U. And you'll notice that, uh, no, this is 6U and this is 6.25. You'll notice immediately one nice thing about the hammer one, the CRP, is that it has the, look at that. It says there are six, Six X over here, so it says it's the six U spacebar over here. So it actually tells you what it is. So that's cool. If you're looking at it and you can't tell, you can see the other ones. It says six point two five at the top. Do you see that? Six point two five, and then over here it says seven. So that's one cool thing. And so far, at least from the space bars I've tested, the CRP one at least works compared to the Android PBT. Android PBT has a lot of problems. New Android PBT has a lot of problems. Old Gadron, I didn't have a lot of problems. So this would be Old Gadron or Old Android PBT because Imsto used to use the their last group I used uh, Gadron which is what Android PBT used to use, but no longer uses that. So you can see, like, look at the bottom, it's different. You can see the space bars are different already. All right, so you just look at the way it's set up. Yeah, so this is the hammer one, you can see. Okay, we probably want to look at that crazy ass left, no, like, grid on the inside. All right, so these are how they compare space bars. It'd be kind of pointless to just compare the straightness because it, it really is pointless because you I will need a bigger sample size of each brand. Okay, now to put them back in the bags because otherwise I'm gonna forget. So this was Imsto. This is Enjoy PBT. This is KP Public. And this is CRP. What's the best of these PBT sites in your opinion? Imsto still, I uh, but you know, it's, it's almost hard to find. So new Android PPT, just wait for new Android PPT. I think that that's, that's, that's the way to go. Wait for future Android PPT sets. But the space might still be a problem. If you want something that is readily available, that means not a group buy, I buy it, I can, I can get it. It'll still take a month shipping, but that's free shipping. If you just want something, that'll work. Something that's cheap, it's reliable. Just get the Capri Public one. Just, just get that. Uh, it won't be beige though. It's a you will see that it's a light gray and it's a grayish set compared to a beige set. Look at so this is the Capri Public one I'm talking about. See how it compares with your usual PBT set. You said this is gray. This is a beige. The Capri Public, Android PBT, Imsto. CRP, Hammer CRP. So you're gonna see the shades, how they compare. Look at that. Maybe I should put it on something flat.
Okay, so just from looking at it, the CRP sets are actually not as warm and not as yellowish as out of all of them, the, the warmest one is Imso, which is Gateron, an old, technically old Gateron, or whatever you want to call it. That's going to be the warmest one out of these four. The yet most yellow one, yellowest one. So let me arrange it by warmth. This will be the most warm one, followed by new Android PBT, or current Android PBT. And then CRP, and then this is just gray, right? This is just a separate thing. I should just leave it separate. So if you need a reference in terms of warmth, this is how I see it. So this is this is definitely the least warm gray over here. And so if you think, if you want to compare it to BSP, I think that BSP is quite warm. From what I remember, it is even, if you have BSP from what I remember, it's going to be over here, actually. It's going to be even more yellow than these. And then if you get uh, OG, what's that one called? OG Cherry, oh, what is it? Man, I don't remember what it's called, hold on. What is it called? Uh, it's the one that's really brown. It's basically the, 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 the most common one that you can find in terms of OG Cherry. What is that one called? Oh, it escapes me. The name escapes me. Just like the R key. Don't remember, but that one is super brown. That one's super warm. Oh, Titty, hello. How are you doing? How's Christmas so far? Fabry Rock says I'm colorblind, so I like what people use dislike usually. Hey, you will like Jim Ken Ecrodan, right? And then Jim Ken says available at the moment. I believe the only place that you can buy them in stock would be yeah, KVD fans from Jim Ken Plant KVD fans or from originative and is that Rasia, Racia, Racia? Welcome to the stream. I believe it's the first time seeing you here. And also, Fabry Rock, thank you for the follow. Seven Lokabura. Welcome, thank you for the follow. Also, no, KP Public, you have to be careful. So not all at KP Public. You have to get their in-house one, not the rest. Only the ones that look like this. You will, you will recognize it though. You Once you see... Uh, not y Yes, this one. If you have questions, join the Discord, ask over there. But there's only one that is actually decent. One series that they make that's actually decent. I would not recommend buying any of the other stuff. Any of the other dice subs, like the 9009. Holy fuck, it's bad. Don't buy that. They're... Topra 909. I believe they had Topra 909. That one is horrible, horrible. Don't buy that one. Uh, again, this is not KB, KBD fans. This is KB Republic. But yes. These, they hit a home run of these. They have quite a few. They have... Th in this one, they have Korean. They have Japanese. They have Cuneiform, Hebrew, Greek, Thai, Vietnamese... That series is, is, I would say, is worth the money for sure. The other ones, avoid. Just run away. First time watching live. Yes, because I, I don't recognize that name. Really want Jim K. Oblivion. Love the modifiers. Hey, I have that. I put that on, on, uh, on some streams. I've put that on. I've actually put that on all the boards. And I actually just took them off a board. Uh, where is it? 
see this was GMK Oblivion Alphas with Serica mods. It was on this keyboard and I took them off. So let me put these back. Yes. I, I look at the link and I can tell already. Yes, that's that's what I'm talking about. So those. So try to find those that look like that. You will see though, they, they will all look kind of similar. Their, their pictures and everything, they will look very similar. They all have that, the, the, the photos, the studio photos that they use will look pretty much in the same style, if you will. So look for those. Is it really called 139? Is that what they're calling it now? Because when I bought it, it was not called 139. It was called something else. It was just, just a generic name, basically. And the nice part, the best part, the best part of buying these sets, you can look at my review and overview, unboxing, whatever. It's on my YouTube channel for the KP Public ones. The best part about them is that you can buy them by individual kits. No, it's not 15 for everything. It's 15 for the cheapest kit. If you buy you know, with the numpad, if everything if you buy a technically full set, it'll end up being about the same price as Enjoy PBT. K Warriors, what's, how's it going? Happy early Christmas. GMK didn't rerun as often. No, 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 no. Yeah, GMK, no. So sometimes it just never gets rerun. It's mostly group buys. Uh, another set that you can pick up, Ratia, Rasha, uh, nothing that you could do is you can buy them directly from Unikey. Can someone link that set? Q, let me let me try to find it. Q.01, is that what it is? Q.01, yes. This is another set you can buy directly and if you're buying from outside Europe, you won't have to pay VAT, so it'll end up being cheaper. I see you don't have to pay Texas. Oh, whoops, I gave you the wrong thing, right? My bad, dude. I'll give you the link. Ignore that and use this. So that's another set that you can buy directly. It ends up being quite cheap, I will say. It ends up being about, was it 150 shipped dollars? Around that. Frosted Flag says, just bought chalk keycaps in Cape Republic. Do you know if it's any good? Give me the link. They sell a lot of keycaps. And I'm gonna say, right off the bat, I'm gonna say not great because if they're great, I, I would have seen them. Cause I check Cape Republic every day. I check Cape Republic, KBD fans, and which is the other, some, there's some other seller on AliExpress that I check every day. But they might be really cheap, so. It's fine. JNK Penumbra Solar Rice. Love this set as well. I actually have. <laughs> so, not the Solar Rice one. Actually, I have Penumbra right here. You'll see it on pretty much every build video. Because I use it to straighten keycaps. Because I don't love it. I don't love it. What sets do you have? I... A lot. The answer is a lot. I've owned a lot as well. I would not be able to count it for you right now though. I, it would take some time to count everything. Not close to even, not even close to the biggest collection obviously, but definitely a lot. That's cause I, I get sick of things and sell them off pretty quickly though.
I think I think that's it. Is that it? I think that's it. Bring this guy closer. Here we unboxed this thing earlier. Look at that. This is from NGB. His wife made this. Let me look at the link for After Flex. One second. That's not even dice up, though, right? That's laser. Oh no, it's dice up. Oh, it is dice up. Um, I don't know. I have not owned the set, but I can tell you not to expect too much. I mean, it is it is pretty cheap, so I can't even try to judge it. Well, hold on, hold on. Sixty bucks for. What keys do you get though? Okay, you get those as well. You only get one space bar. Yeah, so maybe not the cheapest either. But no, I've not seen this in these in person, but It's really hard to just tell from the pictures how good it is. Oh my god, okay. Already I can tell you something is wrong. Okay, look at look at look at me over here. But again, I don't know if you got the extra keys and I don't know whether it affects everything else, but if if it already is a thing in one of the kits, I suspect it might be a problem for some of the others. Okay, so if you look with me, can I open? Okay, I can open image a new tab. Okay, this is already not a good sign. See where shift is over here, and if you draw a straight line, you will see that this one goes down. See that? It's especially obvious if you compare it to this. See how much lower this one is? Over here as well, you'll see that Alt, the A is way, the Alt Legends, way bigger than the FN over here. See that? And usually what happens is when there is, when there is this size discrepancy, the FN will be bigger than the Alt because this is only two letters, it's three letters. So sometimes, so for example, this is really popular with signature plastics. This is what they often do with, so for example, even over here, you will see on SA sets from signature plastics, you will see that, for example, uh, probably not too obvious, I don't have anything. Okay, backspace, you'll see that the A, so backspace in general, is smaller than the alt, letters in the alt, the font size. Because you need to cram more letters over here. So there's two ways to go about this. Gawk and I prefer the same way where it's you basically make them all the same size and then you adjust the font for all of them. For all the mods. To make sure you can fit everything. So that the size as basically as few font sizes as possible within the same set. So that's what Gawk has been trying to do with the Android PPT sets. We're, okay, so again, usually more letters, smaller size. When when there's a size difference. Preferably everything the same, which is what Android, the KP Public set does, and it's my favorite part about the set. You can see that the mods They don't have any crazy differences between the size, font sizes. See that? They at least try to keep, at least looks the same to the naked eye. I, I don't know for sure. I'm not, 
looked at them under a microscope. I don't have access to the original files. But then, okay, so back to, so usually more letters, smaller font. Look over here. FN is smaller than Alt and it makes no sense. Absolutely no sense. You see that? So already these are just things that make, uh, just not a good sign, right? We have this problem, we have this problem. You can see end and delete. E looks big, the, the, the letters look bigger on the, on the end key than delete, even though they're both three letters. Page down and delete as well. You can see the D, the D is bigger over here. Then on delete, which again, makes no sense because if there's gonna be a size difference, the letter should be bigger on this one because there's fewer letters than this one. So again, you might not care about these things, but I'm just letting you know, this is how I look at the sets. And uh, these are things that I think that should be used when you're trying to compare sets. The 1.75 you shift is why I bought the set. Oh no, well hopefully yours is okay. But at least when the picture doesn't look okay. So I don't know. Okay, so I think that's it for today. Thank you so much for being here. We're gonna try to look for someone to raid and then I'll, I'll do a few announcements and then we'll run the credits as well. If you have any last questions, you can go ahead and ask or you can ask on the, the next stream. Oh no, never mind. It doesn't work. Nope. What is your preferred profile? Cherry, by far. So let me look for someone to raid. If you have any suggestions, let me know. I'm gonna run the credits as well. Let me run the credits first. Credits, credits, credits. Oh my god, almost no one is alive. What? Almost none of my friends are alive. I guess everyone's busy with Christmas. Oh, damn. Not a lot of people alive at all. Okay, well, we will look for someone. Makers. Oh my god, I tapped on the wrong keyboard. Makers and crafting. What is that? What is that? happening here nope nope nothing happening here okay is this so I think this is making cosplay stuff so I guess we could look at cosplay costume making because yeah I, none of my friends are live actually so I do that okay you really should add an FAQ section at the bottom of the stream we're at the bottom of the stream, what do you mean? Oh, 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 FAQ. Yeah, a lot of things, but the thing is, you know, it's just difficult keeping all those updated. Yeah, I... Oh, baby. Okay, so let me look at the, okay, new followers. Victor Lincoln Pine, Fabry Rock, Seven Luckbur, or I don't know how to pronounce that. And then people who subbed and resubbed, Red Hawk, 159, Deming Dick, Gil Sub from Talisman Solutions. We have who else? And then for all the people here, thank you so much for being here. 
I know it's a Sunday before Christmas. I hope you have all done your Christmas shopping. Or or not. I shop online, so I don't really care. Uh, so thank you so much all for being here. Unfortunately, CRP did not live up to the hype. It lived up to its name. But not the hype. And I will be streaming tomorrow. I should probably ask if we want to unbox GMK Necro tomorrow or do it some other time. Sind! Hello and goodbye, yes. And VPR says, I have one more thing to buy at the store. Oh no! If you don't do it tonight, it's gonna be god awful tomorrow. I mean, tonight is already bad enough. It's Sunday night. But yeah, so to everyone else. I'm still streaming tomorrow. I'm hoping to stream on Christmas as well. I'm hoping to stream Lego on Christmas. Either that or, or some video games, but I think, I, think I'll, I think I'll do Lego on Christmas. And for those of you who are traveling, please travel safe, drive safe. I hope you and all your loved ones are doing well. If it's cold where you are, stay warm. If it's hot as hell where you are, Take off all your clothes. Um, if you're... There's going to be a lot of alcohol involved. Don't drink and drive. Watch on the road as well because other people are going to drink and drive. And thank you so much for another Christmas. Another awesome Christmas. I've, I've streamed for a little over a year now. And yeah, so to everyone else who won't be here... For the next two days, have a good Christmas. If you're not going to tune in until for, for the rest of the year as well, have a happy new year. And yeah, so to every, unbox Necker tomorrow. Okay, so I'll, I'll have to do a poll because I know some people want, uh, a lot of people can't show up tomorrow. So we will, we will do, a, I should do a poll. Remind me, remind me in Discord actually, I'll forget right after this. But I am going to do the raid, so. Oh my god, this keyboard's not plugged in. I keep forgetting. Thank you all so much for being here. Take care. See you, Sind, Ratia, VPR, Tronix, PC Load Letter, Dewing Dick, Green Savage, Tasman Solutions, Fabry Rock, Frosted Flax, X, Popai, Popage, KB Warriors. Thank you, thank you so much for being here. We're going to do the raid. You can join us there. Say hi to this other maker or to have a good rest of the Christmas season. See ya.